as soon as it's all clear, gonna get the big man running. Unbelievable. I've had to get out of there, it's like a bush tucker trail in there. It's full of these lacy, long-legged spiders. There goes baby. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. We've got Steve the Transit Camper and Big Jay's Big Adventure. And we are going to do a stealth camp where it's a place where when I take Mrs. Baby to work, I've spotted it. And I think it's a good little woods that we're going to get into right by the railway line. So let's get there. We'll see you when we're setting up. You've got to tell everybody, Steve, that we're going old school this time. We are going old school, back to basics. I'm in the Dutch Army tent, you're in the hammock, are you? Amok hammock. Amok hammock. We'll see you when we get there. Let's make this journey quick. Straight away, I've got big Jason, and a lot of danger. There is no pavement. It's a tiny little country lane and it's got two-way traffic on it. He loves me. Steve's in full camouflage. <laughs> I'm in full camouflage, he said. Steve. Hey. Let me go in front. He wants to go in front now. Just to protect he's me. Full, Steve's full camouflage, <laughs> blending in. <laughs> what we're going to do? We're going to get to this street corner, and then we're going to pretend that we're waiting for a lift. And when it's all clear, which it is now, but we haven't got there, we'll run into the woods. Plenty of room. So we just stood at this crossing now, we're pretending that we're waiting for a lift. We're gonna face the traffic. And as soon as it's all clear, we're gonna get the big man running. In here. In here. Show him Steve. I'll show you. And we're going in. No cars about. Now I think this is an area that is totally uninhabited. What do you think? Which way, big man? We're going to keep going that way for about a mile. <laughs> so once you make your way into this forest, it eventually gets to the railway line on my right hand side. We'll be able to see some trains. We love trains. Now in the summer when I went past here, early summer, I could see into the forest. And it looked as though there was a bit of a pass, but there is no pass, so this is good. Right, I might have to render some first aid here. Big Jace has took a hit. He'll be all right when you make Look how tan that hand is. Yeah, where have you been abroad? Been to uh, Dominican Republic. Oh, lovely. It's all right for Sam. This lens needs cleaning. <laughs> I need to wipe it. <laughs> Give me some material. <laughs> I need material. Oh. that? <laughs> right, let me wipe it. Right. Has it made a difference? Yeah, 100% better. Oh, I must be too long. Unbelievable. Have you been taking acting lessons or something? This is ridiculous. Oh, this is good. Find a place 
big chase. This is the place. Whew. This is perfect. So this is the spot we're looking at. I like this. It's going to be nice and flat. I can get the Dutch army tent down and we can get Jason his big hammock from there to there. I'll be tucked in behind him. I'm guarded. Perfect. Big Jason's already asked a question. Is this an electric fence? No, nah, I don't think so. They're just tensioners, aren't they? You tell me. It does seem that wherever you go, there's rubbish. So there's a few cans here, we'll get rid of them. I'll get my little bin bag out now in a minute. There's a few little wrappers and things around. When we leave here, nobody will know anyone's been camping here. Mad. How hard is it to leave no trace, Jace? It's easy. Easy. But these people don't care about leaving no trace. They don't, you're right. It's annoying. So what are you doing now? Are I'm you setting the cameras up because you want me to film the site and everything that we're doing. Yeah, all right, all right. What have, what have you got on your hat? <laughs> Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I wonder what they'll think of like about that across the pond. What do you think, Ray? It is. Are you looking at that? I think you're going to get mixed feelings, mate. Mixed feelings, well. They seem to be voting them in. There's the traffic behind us. Big Jay-Z setting up the camera and then we're going to get some mics on and I'm going to set my tent up. Just grabbing a few things, getting a few things out. Oh, look what we found here. That's good. Big Jay-Z setting up his equipment. He has spotted a CCTV camera over there. But I think it's just watching the yard over there. Tree hugger. It's been well over a year since we've used this. This is the problem. We don't we don't go back to basics enough, do we? Oh, we have too much equipment. Yeah. That we forget how to use any of it. Yeah. And of course, Steve doesn't like to read the instructions. No, I never read the instructions. Good start. We've both got to talk though, haven't we? <laughs> Play back the video, see if the sound's working and nobody's talking. What's this? Bin bag. I've been so looking forward to this cab. <laughs> yeah? But at the same time, just thinking, oh, I've got to go through that again. I could be in bed. <laughs> you know what? Thinking you've got to go through that again and you could be in bed? Yeah, could be in a nice warm bed. Instead, I'm going to be at risk of a serial killer, which is yourself. <laughs> I said chances of two of us out at the same time are pretty low. That was pretty easy. Was it? Yeah. <laughs> it's like when we're under the motorway bridge, we're thinking everybody can see us and nobody yeah, can nobody see us at all. Us and nobody's bothered. But that was the police screeching up the road. I'm definitely going to have to put this on already. Uh, it's getting cold. Yeah, I was a bit brave with just the. Right, mate, before I forget. Yeah. Okay. Take this now. Memory stick. No, oh, it's Viagra. <laughs> yeah, I'll need it for later. Memory stick. Memory stick. I'm giving Steve the memory stick in case he loses it. I am taking. And denies that he even got it. I am taking the memory stick. <laughs> Oh, 
Right, <clears throat> it's been a long time since I put this up. It hasn't been. You used it on the last car, didn't you? The no, last used, proper car. I used a cheap one. Did you? Last time this was used, mate, was on top of the long mend. Oh, right, bloody hell. That's a long time ago, mate. I don't think it's going to rain tonight, is it? I don't know, but... <laughs> Did that for about five minutes, didn't even notice. Didn't I? No. I'm used to it. Where's the bag this come in? What you lost? The bag it came in. It's part of it, isn't it? I don't know, I can't remember. I thought the bag was part of the kit attached to it. Yeah? No, I don't think it is. Maybe I'm wrong. You'll see obviously what you did with it. I haven't had it already, have I? Because I usually do that. You just grab hold of that side, mate. Here's your bag. It's on there. No, that's the other parts of it. No, it's a little paisley bag. Empty? Open? Yeah. yeah. Right. What's this? A tent? Hey. Up to the tree, hang on. So that's, grab, there should be a, a, a green bit, yeah. So that says to the tree. What's the thing? It says on it tree. It should say to the tree. What kind of instructions are they? Right, are you okay just holding that, keeping it off the ground a minute? I'm supposed to be doing the own gear, yeah. yeah? We help each other, it's teamwork. Oh, okay. And you won't just run off? No. Tree hugger. Bin. Oh, well over a year since we've used this. This is the problem. We don't we don't go back to basics enough, do we? Oh, we have too much equipment. Yeah, that we forget how to use any of it. Yeah. And of course, Steve doesn't like to read the instructions. No, I never read the instructions. Good start. Looking good, big man. I think. So it goes, can you pass us the one that says green on it, mate? That's that bit there. Got it? Uh, I think I've done it the wrong way around. Oh, do want it rip on the this thing? This is green. Okay. Gives the red. I do it. This is complicated, isn't it? Yeah, it gives that one. Oh. It gives the red one, mate. Just giving it. I need to face you, don't I? All right. You You're go. getting angry for? I'm supposed I'm to be setting angry. up a tent. I'm always angry. I think that goes in there like that. No. Because that way. <laughs> Be a train coming this way soon, I reckon. We'll be ready. All right. Thanks, big man. It's getting big man set up now. Give me another piece to hold. You just hold this lamp. Can you just hold this lamp for me? <laughs> family channel. Unbelievable. It's never been a family channel. Of course it is. How many families actually write comments? But none that I know like of. The entire family. Alan's family. Alan Dykes, he always writes comments. He's no. a big family man. Alan, does your family watch this? I think he, I think they do. Put it in the comments, Alan. Are you sure he's supposed to go that high? Yeah, because it comes down when you get in it, doesn't it? Oh, 
I don't. Oh. I don't think it is that long since you've had this up. <laughs> what camp do you think I've had this up in there, mate? I'm trying to think now. This needs to come further over that way, mate, because of this branch here. Eh? I think it needs to come further over that. Yeah, just once I get it in, I can oh, adjust it. you can it. change it, can you? Yeah, just... What's this wire? This is deadly. It's actually a nice piece of wire, though. <laughs> There's the engineer inside, Steve. That's There's a nice, nice piece, piece of wire. Of wire. Well, I'm not getting anything done because Big Jace. I'm ready. No, it's all right. You carry on doing yours, and then we'll do mine. We know what our, ours. We know how to set up a Dutch army tent, don't we? You can sit, start doing yours now. I'm all right. I'm just. No, because you're going to get me to. <laughs> there isn't. <laughs> I can't believe how close this is to the road. I'll show you on the map. It doesn't look that close, but when you're here. It's not a very big wood at all. It's all right though. It's that close to the road that we could order a pizza, <laughs> stick my thumb out when it was driving past, take it and you can carry on. <laughs> I think we probably we could. What three words up to give our exact location. Yeah, you'll have all that, don't you? I'll find that in a minute. All right. So that way you can, people can see where we are. Oh, okay. And we'll put it on the screen because yeah. we'll be long gone, won't we? That's a good idea. What's this? What's that? An oxygen absorber. What? No wonder you couldn't breathe. I've just found this. What is it? It's an oxygen absorber. It was inside my tent. Is that That's to stop bugs growing? The last camp. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing to do with your COPD and your chronic lung disease. COPD. What's that for? Put it in the comments. Are we on that camera now? Can you see me on that camera? Yeah. You sure? H have a look at it. Go up to it without putting your big fat face in front of it and see if you can see me now. Unbelievable. <laughs> Which way are you going to be facing? This way, looking up over there. Okay. Look at that, it's a rock right where I want to be. Put your head on that. Big Jay-Z doing a bit of camera work. I'm just getting the old Dutch army tent out. Got some new pegs for this. Much better. Look at them beasts. Beautiful. Well, I think that's stiff enough for a good night. You can't help yourself, can you? What? Did you bring your flag? Yeah. This is good if you don't flip over, I tell you. This is what? This is good if you don't flip. Yeah, it is good. <laughs> mate, what? Mate. I haven't done it. I've yet. no space to get in anywhere. That's enough space. Look, you, I'm, I'm not close. even going to can't get past you. Look. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No space at all. You're that close to me. You might as well be in with you. I might inside get in with me. You if I get a bit. What? I might get in with you. So guys, got Steve's new tent pegs. 
as you can see, um, is after this camp, he's going on an expedition to the uh, Mount Everest. <laughs> That's why he's got these that you have to hammer in. A bit overkill. <laughs> Where are we sitting? Yeah. I think. Well, it could be a joint decision. Unbelievable. Oh, I keep hearing a train. Say again, mate. I keep hearing trains, but it's not. A train? A... Yeah. I keep getting my phone out ready and it's not one. It's almost like we're near a train track. <laughs> you just grab that a minute. What's that say? Are we on camera? Yeah, over there, but probably okay. a bit far away. So I'll just stretch it out so I just get an idea of it. Is your mic still coloured? Right, you grab that one, mate. That's the red one. So I've got the... There's the green. The green. I just need to... Yeah, so I need to get my red one over there, don't I? Yeah, okay. All right. Mind the... Mind my guidelines. I think if we just hook it on. Is that it? Yeah, then you just tie it out. And you peg it out then, don't you? But I can't do it because you're in front of me. What do you mean? Hey? What do you mean? So this has to go, this goes in front. That's like, alright, it'll cover me as well. Got a tree here for this one. Why is that? How is it going for? What would it look like if we just peg it out? Say it again. I'm just trying to... If I just peg it out... What's it look like like that? We want to do it how it's supposed to be though, don't we? It's what? We want it to be how it's supposed to be. I don't get how it works. Oh, that's that there. Okay. So you should, you've got two ends there, haven't you? Hang on, let me I'll I've Google got... it. Because it's got the Amok right in. Oh, nice. Let me, it's on, I'll take it off a minute, I'll Google it. We'll just leave it relaxed, it's not going to rip on the floor. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Well, big Jay-Z has a look at that. I'll just have a quick tour of the camp and show you just how close we are to this main road. This is the one we travelled up. Mrs. Baby brought us up. No one can see me in here. I'm well camouflaged. That's the main road. That's camp. Well hidden. And then just above that's the train track. And hopefully, we'll be pretty well hidden from the trains as well, as they roar past. Ooh, beauty. 
Gotta love a train. It is quite, uh, it's because we don't do it often enough. Yeah, once it? you know, I mean. Like everything. Uh, yeah. Now I know, right, well, that's where your feet go. Yeah. Okie dokie. Because these, you can get them up onto the tree somehow, can't you? That can go over my tent. And wrap it on right over there, can't it? Yeah. Have you got to tie that off, mate, on summit? Have you deliberately hidden my... Delib I've not deliberately done anything before you can accuse me of summit. Stop swearing. What's happened to my sleeping bag? I don't know what's happened. Why would I know what's happened to your sleeping bag? Because you were carrying it. I mean, you carried it last. I was filming you. Has somebody Where did you it? put it? Jack I wonder if I could get the 360 on that. It's over there. Why is it over there? You made it, haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> You're unbelievable. Unbelievable. I just said you were my best mate. I know, I did it because it's funny. <laughs> I did it because I love you. <sighs> Is this going to fall? Am I going to regret this? Is it going to be another 360 camera down the drain? Oh no. Who knows? Stay tuned folks for... <laughs> Jason goes crying in the woods. Right, well, I found my M90 where, from where Jace hid it, behind the tree. Thanks, Big mate. Big Jace. <laughs> right, I think Ooh, hang on. Glasses for hang beer. on. What time is it? Oh, it's nearly <laughs> bedtime, guys. What you know what time is it? it is. What bedtime. <laughs> no glasses, mate. Say it again. I didn't bring any glasses. You did? I didn't. It'd be a stupid idea to bring glasses. Have you not really? No, I've not brought any glasses. They're unbelievable. They aren't glasses, are they? I told you I didn't bring glasses. They're perfect. <laughs> oh yeah, sorry. What, what did you say to your wife about me? I said he won't bring any beer glasses. And she said he, she, he will if you told him to. And I said, you underestimate that chap. <laughs> Brilliant. Do you know what, it's, it's, I love the satisfaction of when you're all set up and you're ready and you can just be like, right. Yeah, the trouble is you like it as much as being packed away as well. I, absolutely. So, so at five o'clock in the morning, you start itching again. Five o'clock in the morning, I've not slept all night. <laughs> and that's why I get up because I'm like, right, I'm going to go home now and have a shower and go to bed. Right. Oh, look at you with your little tarp getting in and out of your tent. You can't. Okay, look at you with your little <laughs> tarp getting out of the tent. Can't use any of that. You're going to have to do it again. Look at you with your little tarp. That's to keep my knees dry, oh, isn't it? Keep my knees dry. Unbelievable. I don't want to be damp in my tent. Oh, have you got any spare pegs? Yeah. Those big ones? Yeah. Oh, mate. How many you got? Uh, about three, I think. Got to have spares. Every good camper has spares, mate. They're not to keep, are they? No, they're just for today, mate. Three? Brilliant. Just tripped over the line, did you see? Yep. <laughs> And again. Great, I've lost one already. He's just asked to borrow some pegs. I gave him three and he's dropped one already. Have you dropped it? Yeah, mine though, not, not yours. Oh. The blue ones. Well, don't mess the foliage up. That's a big mistake, that well, is. Well, no, half of it's sticking in the ground. Oh, is it? So yeah. it's going to be around here somewhere, then. Oh, that's that's not, but... You got it? Yeah, because I got two, so one. 
two and there's one still in there. Alright, wild goose chase then. Yeah. Never mind. Back to cab. Where's your black current? It's in the centre compartment of my bag. I'll take it back about these pegs, these are really good. Take it back, what? That was... Pegs are good? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. That's typically, yeah. Is that good? I'm going to go to go outdoors this week and buy some. They are really good pegs. I got them off... Um, what should I call it? Here's a blue peg just falling off. Where? Just by the tree here. Where's that one from then? I don't know. Oh, it's falling out of your bag. Yeah, there should be two. Oh, uh, yeah, there is. In the bag already. Well, they weren't in the bag properly. It was, you've just pulled them out. It's, it's not about blame, is it? It is. It's a blame culture that we live in. Why, right, I'm putting them back in where that pot came from. Oh, Steve's just gelled his hands in the cold now. Oh, it's all this Guinness, it's sticky. Big Steve, big pussy, that's the next <laughs> one. You can't say that. I can. <laughs> Hi, my name's Steve, welcome to my channel. Big Steve, big pussy. <laughs> That's your channel name. <laughs> <laughs> right, where's my drink? It is, mate. Oh, that's good. Has it got black current in it? Yeah. Thank you, sir. Starting to lose the light now. Oh, lovely Guinness. He didn't bring proper glasses, but I'll let him off for that. Is Big Jace. Look at that. What a beauty. And I don't mean just Big Jace. Oh, you can't beat Guinness and Blackcurrant. Big Jay Z having the first drop of Guinness. Nice. Lovely. This is cool, isn't it? Yeah. I have missed these types of camps. Yeah, it's just good, isn't it? Yeah. You ready for another big man? <laughs> you ready for another have big you, man? What have you done? You spill it? No, I've drunk it. I've been sat here three or four minutes. Cheers, big man. I'm not carrying these out. Oh, my hands are so sticky. Have you got any wipes? Um, I've got alcohol gel. Which will do the same thing. Will that work? Get rid of the sticky? Yeah. I could urinate on your hand. <laughs> Here's Big Jay-Z setting up some lights. We're contemplating doing a live stream, but it never goes well, but we'll give it a go. He's got the sun on top of his head. He loves that. What is that? Oh, a drinking vessel. Nice, like a Viking. Yeah, skull. Cool. <laughs> Look at the Dutch army. It's all getting a bit dark now. This is where it all happens now. This is the magic. Right, let's put this in there. Put this in there. Right, so I'm using the BCB stove because I love it. That spider tent. Big Jay-Z. You're not so keen on this stove, are you? Yeah, I like it. That's why I bought one. Have you got one? Yes. I've got multiple platforms for cooking on. Multiple platforms. <laughs> Do you know, the best cooker we've ever had is that orange thing. We've not used it. Yeah, but it's the best cooking device. Why have we we've not got? used it? Why aren't we using it? The bio light. Yes. With the light on it and everything. Yeah. We okay, love guys, it. on the next stealth camp or the next camp in general. People love the bio light. We use the bio light. 
Nearly bedtime. So excited. No, it's not. We drank eight Guinnesses. Yeah, they've gone. We're on the whiskey now. I'm sure I've not had four Guinnesses, mate. I think you've shafted me. You've had four. A few moments later. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with the spark. Why well, don't we eat that big spider running across the... That's yeah, not see a that. big spider, is it? Oh, it's a big spider. That's a small spider. Oh. Where are you going? Yeah, big Jay-Z's going to do that. I want the biggest pan here. Right, where's the thing? Let's where's just the... put a bit of that on because it's a bit more flammable. No, it's all right. I don't need that because you're going to think that I've only done it because you put that no, on. No, it up. is a bit more flammable. Where's, which way does it go? Just scoop it down the middle. Boom! Oh, that was unlucky. I thought you'd got that then. There you go. Oh, I'll tell you why that's gone so quick. Because I know what I'm doing. No, I think it's because I put a bit of extra I knew stuff you'd on. say that. <laughs> <laughs> right. Why are we burning? We're not going to mess about here. Oh, where's my mobile? <laughs> what? Right. Now this has been prepared by Mrs. Baby. Oh yeah, yeah. That's how, that's how lucky you are. Indeed now, I am, sir. Some people would say this is cheating, but it's not. What it is, is good preparation. It's using the five P's approach. Oh, what's the five P's approach? It's it's proper planning and preparation. But it's six P's, isn't it? Prevents poor performance. It's actually poor performance. No, that's, where that's it comes only from. your version. No, that's where the P comes from. Right, we're gonna have to. Where's the other? Where's the other part of it? We're gonna have to do this in two sessions. That's other part of what? There's more. I was more actually what? being sarcastic, saying that's not enough for one person. <laughs> <laughs> then I saw the other part that you've pulled out. Right, I'm prepared to let you go first as well on this. No, you go first, mate. No, you go first. No, you go first. I'm happy to go second. Have you got spoons? Yeah. Got everything. There we go, this is warming through. Nice. Big Jay-Z will go first on this Have one, because I'm a good boy. In it? Oh yes. You're gonna love this, sir. Oh I've got a cramp. Steve the transit cramper. <laughs> <laughs> Steve the transit cramper. Oh, he's got cramp. Hi guys, welcome to this episode. Today I've got cramp. <laughs> <laughs> that could be a very limited show, couldn't it? Yeah. Channel. Hi, right, Steve, the transit cramper. Cramped up again. Cramped I'm up again. I'm not going to be able to do the show tonight. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm cramped up. If you like cramping, then please, uh, <laughs> anything to do with cramping or cramp, then please subscribe. <laughs> Thank you very much. That's going to work, isn't it? Look at that, guys. That's amazing. That is going to work. The heat is going to transfer through all the bottom one, which is burning on the base. It's all very clever working through. They call that preheating. Superb. The bottom one's obviously going to cook through. Top one's just going to get a bit of a warm. I think maybe you need to stir the bottom one, mate. Yeah, I'm going to. That's coming off now. It's just an idea. Don't tell me how to cook. You're shit at cooking. Yeah, I've never cooked for you. You can't cook. I used to work in a restaurant. <laughs> for Gordon Ramsay. But you were a waiter. For you Gordon Ramsay. You worked in Hooters. <laughs> <laughs> it's still a restaurant. You wore a tight vest. <laughs> you kept the guys out. No, I actually got barred from Hooters. Oh. 
you're you're amazed by this, aren't you? What do you mean amazed by it? Well, look at it. This has been lovingly prepared by um, Mrs. Yeah, Baby. I'm looking forward to it. I know you are. It smells scrumptious. And I'm making sure it doesn't stick for you, big boy. It's not a word I heard the other day, and I've not used it for a long time, and it's such a nice word. What? Swanky. Oh, very swanky. This is a swanky dinner. I have brought a little bit of whiskey. Have we got a pudding? A couple of cans of Coke, and there is pudding. Yes, sir. It's that cold, I can even feel the heat from here. It's so cold, isn't it? It's like 12 degrees, though. We've done six. No, it's not. It said six. No, it did not. It said six Show in the weather. Me. No. It said six. 12. Or six. Lows of 12, it said. We're nowhere near six. If we were six, we'd be in our tents now, crying. Look here. Hey Siri. Look here, big Jay-Z. What's the temperature now? I can't tell your location because of your settings. That is nice. That is really nice. That is beautiful. Yeah, how much was that? I think it was 23 quid. You gotta hold it up to the camera. There you go, mate. Hold that. Oh, yeah, I'll just forget cooking. It'll be all right for a second. All right. Look. Steve, the transit camper. Look at that. I was thinking of hanging it up over the tent now, tonight. Yeah, that's really a bad idea. Yeah? Right, stir my food. That's warm enough, mate. No, it's not. I'll decide when it's warm. It's chicken. We're not messing about. It's cooked though, isn't it? It's pre-cooked. Yeah, it is cooked, but I want it hot for you. Check your spoon, make sure it's clean. What kind of spoon is this? This is a spoon for Knickerbocker Glory. <laughs> if you guys know what a Knickerbocker Glory is. They know what a Knickerbocker Glory is. Yeah, Everyone but in America does. or other parts of the world, they might not know what a Knickerbocker Glory is. I think it comes from America, doesn't it? Knickerbocker Glory? Yeah. Does Knickerbocker Glory come from America? Put it in the comments. Can you say Knickerbocker Glory five times? I think it came from America. Can you say it five times, Steve? Knickerbocker Glory, Knickerbocker Glory, Knickerbocker Glory. Oh my God, there's a clown just turned up. I think that is okay now. Okay, I'm ready. That's yours. Thanks, big man. No, it goes in a bowl. Not messing oh, about. I'll eat it from that. No. You're going to have to Do wash to the ball in the that? morning, yeah. Sure? Yeah. Uh, it's giving me the hot end. Thanks, big man. Now, this is homemade by Mrs. Baby. What do you think? It's delicious. Is it? Is it good? Yeah. Thank you, Mrs. Baby. Is it warm enough? Mmm. Superb. It's very hot. It's very nice. What's in it? I don't know. You talk us through it, Steve. Not really. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Just put mine on now. I've gone second, being a gentleman. You can eat it cold, really, can't you? Made a massive <laughs> <back to> <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> it's good, but I'm going to need a massive. <laughs> Really? <laughs> oh, gonna yeah. move some stuff down the pipeline. <laughs> <laughs> There's so much to be said about pre-cooking the meals before we come yeah, out. Yeah, it's good stuff as well, isn't it? Is it hot? Mmm. It's too hot. Too hot? Yeah, I can't just stuff it in my mouth. <laughs> Survival Sam is after that. Yeah. It's a shame you weren't around when he came for a cup of tea. It was great fun. Hi. What was it great fun? Oh, just having a chat and that. It's good fun. 
What was great fun about it, though? Oh, here we go. You're getting jealous, aren't no, you? No, I mean, what, what was like, just having a chat oh, we and, a, and a cup of tea, but what makes it great we fun? We started making <laughs> balloon animals or something. <laughs> what makes it great? We were telling stories and that. Like what? Stories of survival with Sam. Mine's nearly ready, looking good. Mine's nearly empty. Big Jay-Z's, all the set is. Where's the pudding? Are you enjoying it? Where's the pudding? You have to wait until I've had mine before you have a pudding. What are those things that look like earplugs on the thing there? Where? On your bag. Those bead things. Oh, I can't tell you. Oh, is that part of the pudding? Can't tell you, it's part of the pudding. Right, calling it. I'm not waiting any longer. It's ridiculous. We've got a little fire now. Oh my god, it's delicious. It is really nice. This is better than your last meal, isn't it? <clears throat> Certainly is. Time's pushing on. Time to get into the tents. I'm absolutely freezing. We've had a few Guinnesses. We've had a bit of whiskey. A big Jay-Z is ready. I called it tonight, which is unusual. But we're getting in. I'm getting in the uh, Dutch Army tent and we'll watch big Jay-Z get in the Amok. Here he is, big Jay-Z, right outside my tent. What's he up to? He's got some fine adjustments to make there, and you, big man. What's up? Got some fine adjustments to make. Yep. You're not stripping off, it's freezing. It's cold. It is a cold one tonight. You'll demonstrate how you get in this in a minute. For anybody who doesn't know how to get in an amok, Big Jay Z is your man. He'll give us a full demo. Big Jay's taking off his suspenders. Look at that leg. Unbelievable. Big Jay's taking off your wife's knickers. Hey! Oi! It's a family channel. <laughs> He's going to be popping himself in there shortly. Just got a few final adjustments to make by the look of it. It's nearly ready. Maybe in for 10 minutes, can I get in now? No, you're pretty good at it now. You don't seem drunk enough either. Fireworks night. Some chap in a. I used to enjoy that. I must admit. Used to have. Used to come down the wild cup on our quad bikes and listen to the boom boom boom. Well, it's definitely a cold one, isn't it, mate? This is colder than we thought it was going to be. Big man, I'm going to get in. All right, matey. Here we go. He's going to pop himself in now. It's very straightforward. That's as nice. you've seen many times before. <laughs> He's got the big green light on. Just pops his head under there. <laughs> <laughs> He's done it wrong again. <laughs> the stuff has fallen out. Bit of a false start up there. <laughs> He's got the chair. Yeah. Oh, we're going to use the chair. Utilise the chair. Interesting. He's going to jump in. <laughs> ah, uh, you made that look easy then. He's on it. He's on it now. The problem is, he 
can zip himself in. I told you to put the string on your zip. I know. Oh. <laughs> can you zip me in, mate? Of oh, course I can. I'm gone. Go. Yeah, I'll do it. Down, down, down. I'm watching your balance. He's got it. Cheers, mate. I'm pulling it tight for you. Oh. He's in. I'm in. Superb. Oh. Oh. Awesome. I'm going to zip up. And I'm going to say goodnight to the big man. Good night. All zipped up and finding some space to settle down. Right, that's it from Steve the Transit Camper and Big Jay's Big Adventures. Good night, my friend. Good night, buddy. See you in the morning. See you in the morning, folks. Take care. Still not level. Two o'clock in the morning. Big Jay's up. Good morning. <laughs> Guess what he's doing, folks? He's decided that this isn't level and he can't sleep. Because I'm, ro I'm rolling to one side. Yeah. So he's up. Adjusting his hammock. I'm gonna pack up now. You are not gonna pack up now, it's only two o'clock. No, I'm joking. <laughs> so because I heard a load of activity, I've got up, had a little tinkle, and I'm back in bed. Ugh. It's a long night really. I've been awake for about half an hour. I heard a bit of movement, I think. That's what uh, woke me up. What's got you up? Bit of movement. Yeah, movement. A bit of bowel movement. No, no bowel movement. <laughs> oh, it stinks in here. It does not stink. It, does stink. it doesn't. <laughs> oh. He means the smell of the Dutch army tent, nothing else. Catch you in the morning. Right, what time is it? It's, uh, it is 5.40. Whew. I've had to get out of there. It's like a bush tucker trail in there. It's full of these lacy, long-legged spiders. Does your head in. I don't mind them too much, them type. There was nothing of the black, angry ones. But you just know that they're a bite and you feel them run across your fingers. Oh, can't be doing with that. So I've bailed out early. Let me see if I can show you any of them. It's those little critters there. And there's been many of them. I can't see any more there. You might see them on camera. Absolute pain. Here's Big Jace. I've woke him up. He was having a bit of a snore. Nice and sleeping nice. Yeah. Nice and comfy. Off the ground. And I've wrecked it because I've had to come out of my bush tucker trial. No spiders. I reckon I got all the, what do they get? All the stars. <laughs> Big man's doing a bit of packing away. Yeah. I'm gonna do me M90. Six o'clock, started taking stuff down. Rubbish is in some plastic bags. Hopefully I'll find one more plastic bag to put the rest in. I'll start taking camp down and wait for daylight. It's all coming down now. We're cracking on. We're going to get the stuff put away. Hopefully we need to get a bit of daylight going. And then we'll send the tax to Mrs. Baby to come and collect. Probably at the same place, I would imagine, where they dropped us off. Awesome.
Here he is. The Amok is nearly down. What a comfortable sleep I've had in that. Yeah, you have had a comfortable sleep. I've, I haven't really slept. I was, as I said, it was full of spiders, so couldn't get into the old sleep, really. I slept initially, didn't I, on the whiskey? You are. I slept initially. Yeah. Good three hours, four hours, maybe. Yeah. We just caught a couple of trains, but I found out I was filming me and not the train as it went past. Here it is. But you'll be able to see the joy on your face. <laughs> Thinking you filmed a train. Women don't get trains, do they? No. There's the rubbish. Big Jay-Z's nearly done. And we've got daylight coming through. They're like, come on, me wanna go home. Yes, we do. We couldn't have a coffee because we couldn't clean the saucepan and we forgot to bring a vessel to boil water in, but never mind. That's what camping's all about, especially stealth camping. You've always got to forget summit. Right, just having a quick walk around camp. Leaving no trace. There is the odd bit of litter around here, but I have got three bags in my rucksack, so I'm not taking any more than that. And we've covered the body up really well so that nobody will find it. There's no body. And we're on our way back. Well, we've arrived back and we're waiting to be picked up now by Mrs. Baby. In the background is where we were. It's a bit of a clue. We've enjoyed the staff camp. It was nice to get back to basics. You've been watching Steve the Transit Camper and Big Jay's Big Adventure. You take care. See you guys. Out.